Hi guys, welcome back to Karamia's Corner. Join me today for a Dollar Tree and Target Dollar Spot haul. First up, I wanted to show you some cards I found and this cute little plushie from Target's Dollar Spot. This was $3. Super cute and soft. So I got one for a friend of mine and myself. And then for um, the Dollar Tree, I found some Thanksgiving cards that I'll be mailing off this week. So they're really cute. Two for a dollar. So I thought that was a super deal. Look at that cute, adorable cat. And we have this cute one with the turkey. Something uh, more simple, but with the leaves, autumn leaves and some gold foil on the card. I love this one. So I'm sending this to my uh, sister-in-law. She has a corgi and um, super cute card. And then we have this cute illustration with a wreath and squirrel and bird. And they also still had some Halloween cards. So I went ahead and bought some for next year. Really cute. I love this one. And this one's super adorable. Now for our Christmas uh, holiday cards, I got some of these money holder cards. Uh, a couple each. So we have this one with the cute penguins. And then I love this one with the reindeer looking up the star. Really pretty. And then I got three of these. I just love the vintage look to the illustration to these cards. So I might use this for a journal and I'll use the others for, um, for a gift card. And then got this for my grandma. Really nice card. I love that it has that classic snowman look with the holly. Um, we have that bird, really pretty. And then got this for my mom. So I'll be mailing her a package, a holiday package soon. Really cute card. And we have these fun cards that I'll be mailing to some friends and family as well. So it'll be a mix. I really like that they're doing snow angels in the snow. Super cute. And here's a really cute one with the woodland creatures playing around the Christmas tree. So I thought that was cute. And of course, we have one with Santa. Um, I found this cute little mug. I love foxes. And I thought it would be a good pen holder. I wouldn't use this for uh, drinking tea. Um, it says it is dish dishwasher and microwave safe. But I think I'll use it for my pens. At their uh, coloring section with the coloring books, I found this Na Fancy Nancy book that I got for my niece. She likes Fancy Nancy, so I think she'll love that. And then I got a coloring book. Uh, my daughter Emmy loves Stitch, so I thought I'd put this in her uh, little box for the holidays, something that she can uh, still color and enjoy. And there's so many um, different activities inside. So I have that. And then from the Target Dollar Spot, but well, before I go there, uh, my Dollar Tree finally started carrying some of the uh, crafters square items. The only ones that I did find were these adhesive glues. So I was only able to find one um, and I looked at their shelves. We have a pretty small store. They didn't have any of the other paper packs that I usually see in the halls. And then I got one of these magnifying lights that also comes handy. It has a little LED light and a magnifying glass in pink and uh, was able to find kind of this burlap lace trim and it says it's nine feet long and for a dollar it's nice. So I'm going to be uh, using it for uh, one of my open spine journals and I'll be sharing a flip through of that soon. So stay tuned. At the Target Dollar Spot, I got a couple of these faux leather bookmarks. I think these are fun as stocking stuffers for the ones in your family that love to read. This one just says, just one more page to be continued. And I love the little tassel attached to it. Another fun idea to include are these pocket straws. So they're silicone and includes a brush and a silicone straw. So we'll look at that and open 
one of them to see what they look like and we have this one in pink. I also got one of these stamp sets with the holly. I thought that would be nice to create a little seal with that. They also had these adorable little zip-up pouches that are perfect to include in the teacher's little holiday little gifts that I'll be giving out to my kids' teachers. I like this one. It says teacher survival kit. So it comes with a ruler, apple-shaped paper clips, and uh, sticky notes. So that'll be a cute little goodie for them. And then here's one uh, that has a gift tag holder, a notebook. Let me open one so we can see them. So here we have a coffee fund gift card holder. Super adorable little note, sticky notepad, and a spiral notebook with blank sheets. How cute, so the teacher can carry it in their purse. So we have that. So I got a few of those that I'll be giving out. And I thought this set was a better uh, deal than this one here. So this one has a ruler and it says make today ridiculously amazing and we have a sticky note pad that says what day is it and we have the um, paper clips that are shaped like apples so I think that'll be fun uh, to include as gifts for the teachers. I mean I know they're working so hard with uh, the distance learning, just helping the students uh, feel comfortable with school. And then a few other cute items. I found this little cute wooden tag and it says Mrs. Claus Bakery. And it'd be nice uh, when I, you know, when we bake some goods and give it to friends and family. So I just got a couple of these. These are a dollar each. Got one of these uh, desk calendars, uh, 2021, I cannot believe this year, it's almost over and let's hope that next year will be much better. I also got this set here, it's a luggage tag and luggage flare, so you put it on your strap and I love what it says, not your bag. And this is Jet Setter, so hopefully sometime soon uh, we will be able to travel again and then I got some of these stocking stuffers again. So for some of the kitties that I want to give gifts to. So we have this adorable polar bear little paint set. I got three of these. Put that right there. Here's the other one. And this one also I got for my niece. I think she'll like this. It's a memory memory game. Let me just open it and see what it looks like. Oh wow, this is open. I hope it's complete. That wasn't sealed, but I think it is. So you have these cute little creatures with the owl. We have the moose and these are fun games to play with the kids any day. I mean it could um, be a rainy afternoon, it just practices your memory to little fox, some snowflakes, look at that raccoon, more foxes, moose, too cute, and a bear, and we have the raccoon, so that's super cute, and this will be great to hang on the tree, and then they can uh, put the little label on it, and then I found these adorable little scrunchies that I'll be also giving as gifts and it's a three pack look at this one it's they're like uh three dollars so a dollar each this one has unicorn I love the fluffy and all these wonderful colors and then we have another set here with more of the shimmery stuff that the kids seem to like so I got those and then for crafting I wanted to do some decoupaging projects using these little wood uh, wooden pieces they're a dollar each so we have a cardinal i got a couple of these so stay tuned for that craft with me session excited to experiment and see what we come up with and also found a couple of these foxes so excited to work on those i have 
just a few more items. One is a chocolate tasting journal. I love chocolate. This is a dollar. They had a beer tasting, a wine tasting journal. They also had a cheese tasting journal. So I thought it would be fun. I usually receive a lot of chocolate boxes in the holidays. So I thought this would be fun to have in my journal. So we have a different categories here for color, sweetness, flavor profile, and rating, and some fun pages to fill. So excited about that. At the ornament station, I found these cute uh, little fawns. And at Marshall's, I did see the bigger ones. They were $7.99. They're really pretty. I might go back and get one of those, but these are cute too to have. On our Christmas tree and I couldn't leave without getting one of these adorable gnomes he has a cute little bell on top of his head and a really cute fluffy beard so I thought this was really cute and he has a pink outfit so that's it stay tuned uh, for I think I'm gonna have a Ross Marshall's haul coming up soon so if you are looking for some holiday or crafting ideas stay tuned for that haul coming soon okay thanks again for watching caramia's corner see you next time bye